What is going on you guys? Alex here with T-Sportline bringing you another Tesla video. Today we're in the Model 3 and we're going to be checking out and installing our new yokes for Model 3 and Model Y so you can get that Model S look. We've got a couple different versions of these, a black leather and then a black leather with a carbon fiber insert on the sides. So let's go ahead and jump in here, take our stock wheel off and replace it with the yoke. All right, first we're going to need to release the airbag. There's going to be one of these holes on each side of the wheel. And we're going to take a flathead screwdriver and we're just going to stick it in here. And we're going to use this to release the airbag clips. All right, now with the airbag out, we're just going to need to remove this yellow plug. There's a little tab on the top and bottom that we can press in and just pull straight out. All right, now we need to remove this 10 millimeter Allen head bolt and we can do this with an impact or a long breaker bar. If we use the breaker bar method, we're probably going to need to hold the wheel and brace it as we break it loose. All right, now that we have the wheel removed from the vehicle, let's set the stock steering wheel and the yoke up on a bench and we can transfer the necessary parts over to the new yoke. We're gonna start by flipping the wheel over and releasing the three tabs holding the horn switch. There's also two electrical connectors going to the horn switch. They can simply be pulled off. Next, there's four Torx T25 screws we can remove. Now we'll be able to remove the control panel from the wheel and this simply snaps into the wheel so we can grab it by the edge and start pulling it up. Just work slowly and carefully along the edge here, pulling up the control panel. There's one wire with a black plug end that plugs into this blue plug. That's the only one we're gonna to need to remove to remove the control panel from the steering wheel. It will simply pull apart. The assembly steps on these parts are exactly the same as they were to disassemble the stock wheel. Lastly, there's the airbag release spring. This is pretty easy to remove just by pulling one edge in and you can release it from its tabs. Going back in the car, we can line the steering wheel up. There's two square openings for the electrical connectors that pass through. This makes it very easy to line the wheel up. Now we can connect our brown electrical connector from the steering wheel to the car, and we can start our 10 millimeter Allen nut. Once we go ahead and fully tighten the Allen nut, all that's left to do is plug up the airbag and snap it back into position, and we are finished. All right, and that does it for us today on this Tesla Model 3 yoke installation. All the functionality of the stock sedan wheel with the looks and feel of a Model S. If you have any questions about what we did today, make sure to leave a comment down below. We'd be happy to help. 
If you're not already, make sure to subscribe and hit the bell to be notified whenever we post new videos. We've got lots more Tesla content coming very soon. Thank you for watching and we will see you in the next one.